Hey guys, it's Felicia with Happily Ever After Living. In today's video, I thought it would be so fun to share with you guys what I ate in a week while on our six night, seven day Caribbean cruise. Now, I do want to preference this video with a few caveats. Number one, I am currently on my 100 pound weight loss journey. And I'm also in week two of intermittent fasting. Yes, what was I thinking to start that before a cruise as such? However, I do wanna let you guys know I did not hold back. I literally ate everything that I wanted to eat during this cruise. Even I typically do not eat flour nor sugar, but you will see in this video, I'm gonna share with you guys where I did taste some carrot cake and I did have fish that had um, a batter on it, but it's fine. My husband and I were celebrating our anniversary as well as his birthday. And yes, we had an amazing time, but I'm going to share with you guys, like always, the ups and downs and all the joys of this journey. I hope you enjoy this video. All right, guys, we're here. We've made it. Here is our, here's the balcony. But of course, right now, all you can see is Miami, but hopefully we'll get some better views later. Itty bitty bathroom. Da da. I am currently at 27 hours and 38 or 48 minutes. So I am getting ready to have some vitamin C here. Um, and then I have my water bottle which is here. And then I also have like a little tea bag inside. Um, I only drink flavored tea. It's actually one of those I showed you guys in the grocery haul. One of these, I brought these with me. It's a mango and passion fruit. So we're gonna go up. We haven't set sail yet. So we're gonna go up and so I'll probably be at a total of 25 hours fasted by the time I finally get some food, but I'll show you guys what I get. It was not what you want after 28 hours of fasting i'll say that um i wish that i had been able to like prepare my own food but that is not the case for the next six days so now i am just sipping on my tea and my vitamin c i'm still maybe about 30 minutes from eating and i'm trying to decide if i want to go ahead and close my window until tomorrow or if i want to leave it open For a little bit later so i'm gonna take a look and see what's going on tonight and then i'll let you guys know okay so i decided that i'm going to go ahead and keep my window open we have dinner at like the main data hall at 5 30. so hopefully i can get some good veggies um and because even though i'm fasting i still try to eat like as nutrition as nutritional dense as possible so yeah, that's what we're going to do. I'll show you guys what I have at dinner. And then I think after dinner, I may go ahead and close my window and start fasting for tomorrow. Welcome to day one. 
in the dining hall. So I really went in like with no serious expectations. I thought that I would be able to get more veggies, but I wasn't. So I started with this starter here, which I wasn't too crazy about. So I didn't eat much of that. Um, get familiar with the shrimp cocktail because I had that literally like every night. And then here was my main course. Um, that's how much was remaining. I was starting to get a little full. And then here was my fruit and I also didn't finish that, but I ate like to my heart's desire. All right, so it is around 8 p.m. We are about to go to a comedy show. No, it's 8.47, comedy show starts at 9.15. I'm not hungry, I'm just going to the comedy show and then maybe I'll have some water and just keep drinking water tonight. But here are my newer jeans, the size 14s and I think it may almost be time to go down the size. I'm okay with that. These were supposed to be my freaking jeans. They were supposed to be a little bit more tight, but I had to pull them all the way up because they were kind of like droopy. Look at that. It's okay though. I'm not complaining. This is not a complaint. I'm excited. So I probably won't eat again until tomorrow for dinner. Um, tomorrow morning my plan is to get up and go work out like walk and get some steps in currently because I didn't work out this morning um, because of the longer fast so I'm currently at 7,787 steps so I'm pretty sure I'll hit 10,000 steps before the night is over all right I'll check it in a little bit bye good morning guys it is day two we are in the Bahamas it is 8 22 I just came back from my husband and I went down to the dining room because he wanted to see what their breakfast looked like. But can I show them? Can I show them the breakfast you got, please? So the breakfast, you guys, it looked amazing. As a matter of fact, I think that I may enjoy breakfast more than I've enjoyed dinner. So now I'm trying to debate if I want to. Let me show you guys some of his food real quick. See that? And he was smart enough to bring a little Tupperware dish so that he can bring it back and eat within his window. I should have done something similar, but I did it. Um, what I'm trying to debate is if I want to switch my eating window from dinner to maybe um, like at lunch or breakfast. I don't know yet. But he still wants to go to the dining room each night. So I may look a little crazy, but... I'm probably gonna just go to the dining room and have coffee while he's eating. And it wouldn't be so awkward if there were not other people at the table with us. But I kinda like told them a little bit about me and intermittent fasting and stuff. But it's like the same people every night. And sometimes people are weird about like when they're eating and you're not eating. So, I don't know don't know let me check my app and see how long i've been fasting so so far i've been fasting for 13 hours and 21 minutes and the reason why i'm trying to decide if i want to switch my meals is because today like this morning my stomach it's it just feels so heavy like i have not felt this in quite some time and i also feel like i didn't get enough veggies yesterday um, so that's kind of why I'm thinking maybe switching my eating window to lunch so that I can make myself a salad, maybe have some other foods, but I'll be sure to update you guys because that is one thing I don't like how I'm feeling right now, like my stomach, oh my gosh, it just feels so, it's like hard. I granted, I probably need to poo because I haven't done that yet today, and usually I do that at the top of the morning. <sighs> struggle it's not really a struggle i'm enjoying myself i'm gonna go out and have a great time today my goal is to get 10,000 steps in have some fun and i'll figure out the food part at some part but i'm not hungry so that's great um i had coffee this morning and i'm drinking my water just trying to stay hydrated but i'll check it in a bit <laughs>
exactly 9 45 and we are rounding out day two and you guys saw what i ate earlier and since then that's all i've had to eat and i don't feel hungry we've been out and about just doing things around the ship feeling great i am feeling great day three 11 35 and i am going to have my first meal probably like around 12 or so i'm taking my water bottle and i have my tea in there for when i open my window and i also have my emergency which i'll dump in here whenever i open my eating window so we're gonna go hang around the boat a little bit and then from there we'll go ahead and have some lunch and today i'm gonna have an, a longer window open because i also want to eat dinner with the husband tonight so today i broke my fast after 22 hours and then i left my window open for about seven hours so you guys can see here i had some yummy nachos and a ton of fruit and i thoroughly enjoyed this meal mm, yum delicious <laughs> guys i cannot even begin to explain how much fun we had in labadee amazing 
Um, they also had the cruise line provided food um, while we were at the beach. However, we did not eat um, while we were at the beach, but we did eat once we got back on the boat ship. Once we got back on the ship. All right, it is day five. We just came back from having a nice swim here in Lavity, um, Haiti. My hair is soaking wet, so I just washed it. So I'm about 18, 18 hours and 20 minutes. I have to go back to my house. So for all my swimmers out there, I know you guys can relate to how hungry you feel after just being in the sun and swimming. So I had a very nice salad here, also some shrimp fried rice. And then I also had fries with like sauerkraut and some type of chili sauce on top and also some bacon. So I was ready to go in. So this is what I started with. And then here is how I finished. Um, so sometimes I think I want more than what I do, but I did eat a good amount here. This is what I had remaining. Oh, and I also had this pair once I got back to the room. What did she do? Nothing. Love to see you. Day six. Day six. We're almost done. So, I've had such an amazing time. Thank you guys so much for sharing this time with me. I hope that you enjoyed seeing what I ate while I was on my cruise during my weight loss slash intermittent fasting journey. Please don't forget to come back and tune in for tomorrow's video as I do my weigh-in to see how I did this week. We'll see if I gained weight, lost weight, stayed the same. Yeah, so don't forget to come back and watch that video. And also, thank you guys so much for being here. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. And I'll see you in the next video. Bye.